Hi guys, my name is Philip and you're watching Artists Using Linux. In this video I will show you how to set up a basic uh, project, uh, how to connect it to your audio interface and how to record an audio track. I'm using Ubuntu Linux and um, I'm connecting it to a Behringer uh, Euphoria 404 HD which is uh, connected by audio jacks to a Roland JDXi synthesizer. So let's get to it. When we open up Bitwig, um, this uh, screen shows up and we can um, first go to settings and to audio and use driver model ALSA. That is the standard one uh, I'm using and that's the standard uh, audio driver for uh, Ubuntu Linux. Uh, then we have Jack and Pulse Audio, but today we're not going to go into this. Jack is basically a more advanced um, way of connecting your audio uh, interface to the, uh, to the software, but for now we're going to use ALSA. And since I'm using the Behringer um, Euphoria, I'm going to select it here. Here we can choose the sample rate. Uh, most of the people today are using 48,000 uh, 48, hertz. Uh, I'm using 44.1 uh, kilohertz uh, because just that's the way I like it. I don't know. Um, next, uh, my audio interface has four channels and I group them into two pairs, into two stereo pairs. Uh, if you want, uh, you could add like four mono uh, pairs or or you can add two mono and one stereo or whatever so you can choose it's important to add at least one channel that you're going to be using or you're going to, going to be recording so now I'm going to add one stereo channel at um, uh, channels one and two and if you look at here these are the inputs one and two um, output buses uh, could, can be complicated if you like you could add various different things here but we will add only one set of speakers my audio interface has four outputs so you could add like a headphones output or change it to something else but for now we're gonna leave it as is then we go back to uh, the main user over here and go to new project this will open up this interface over here I like to turn off this uh, scene panel, just press, press here, you can change it here. And we are going to arm our audio track. To add a, a next, an, another audio track, you can select the right button and then go to add audio track. But we are going to leave it as is and just hit record over here to arm the track for recording. Here, we are going to select our input and we're going to set stereo in. That's the one I uh, used before. And when I press play on my synthesizer now, there's audio input coming in. So at this moment, we are almost ready to record. So I'm going to set the, set the track to 140 BPM because that's the tempo of the song I have in my synthesizer. It's not important here right now, but I'm going to use it like that. So. If I press record here and start the track and hit play on my synthesizer, the track is going to record. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you like this video and if you would like to see more, please subscribe, leave a comment um, and be free to uh, maybe uh, write suggestions about what to record next. See you next time.